It's minus seven degrees Celsius in Moscow, but that doesn't stop the amateur football team Alabusheva. They play at least once a week, no matter what the weather. Alexander Murachin has been playing with the team for two years. He's a school sports teacher, but on and off the pitch, soccer has always been his passion. Here in Russia, football is the game of the people. You have to pass, strike, shoot beautiful goals. We may not be at the World Cup, but we definitely try to play an elegant game. Over 700,000 tickets to the World Cup in Russia have already been sold. So far, about half of them have gone to the country's own fans, including Alexander. There are reminders of the upcoming event dotted across Moscow, even a countdown to the kickoff. And the majority of Russians feel positive about hosting the World Cup this coming year. It's a good thing, of course. A lot of tourists, a lot of guests will come. We're always happy to have guests. It's a serious major event. And I know that a lot of people are already buying tickets online. People here are definitely looking forward to the World Cup. The World Cup has given a boost to the infrastructure of cities like Rostov-on-Don, Nizhny Novgorod, Saransk, and wonderful stadiums have been built. Now the guests just have to arrive. The city of Moscow has been feverishly preparing as well, investing one and a half billion euros to improve pedestrian zones and roads. In cooperation with FIFA, the city has even given one of its metro trains a makeover. It will be spreading the soccer spirit across Moscow until the end of the World Cup. But Alexander and his teammates won't be needing any encouragement when it comes to the soccer spirit. Today they're watching a game at a teammate's local bar. Alexander has been an avid football fan since he was six. He'll of course be backing his home team at the World Cup and will be watching the draw closely. We're the hosts, so the main thing is for us to at least come first or second in our group. We hope that the Russian team will end up in an easy group. The whole country is hoping for an easy group. The Russian national team currently is the lowest ranked of all the World Cup participants. But no matter who wins, fans like Alexander can still enjoy a month of the beautiful game. Yeah!